morning people i hope you're all good okay so i'm just gonna try and make this as quick as possible because i'm literally four minutes behind time so this morning i'm meeting my friend we're going breakfast club for breakfast this morning and um this evening i'm gonna be hanging out with my sister-in-law so you get to come along and see i don't really do much but you know since i finally got some things doing in the uk i thought why not bring you guys along with me so you're gonna come along and see that um yeah um, as i said i'm four minutes behind schedule it's um 10 5 now and i wanted to have a slice of cake before i go which i probably still will do because um i can't hold my baby until 11 o'clock so <laughs> yeah i'll see you guys shortly <laughs> Take, excuse me take my time and actually run you through exactly what's happened so this morning i went to the breakfast club in london bridge met my friend there we had a nice breakfast um it was nice you know what i find quite ironic i was asked well we both were asked well all the customers because i overheard the people beside me being asked the same question which was um whether we had any allergies or anything like that and i mentioned to the lady i didn't want pork i didn't eat pork and i wanted my eggs well done and i literally got pork on my plate up suck <sighs> anyway ignore that i just want to just say that because um why not so anyway i'm gonna meet my sister-in-law now i'm all dressed and ready to go i'm literally wearing what i was wearing last week but in a different color so it's just a lot going on but you'll probably get a better glimpse of it um when i'm there because i will be vlogging um yeah so i'm just gonna go now it's like four minutes past six i'm trying to get there for half past i'm going rum's kitchen by the way in brixton I'm trying to get there for half past i don't think i will get there for half past but we'll see anyway so yeah i guess i'll see you guys when i get there This is going to be a continuation from rum's kitchen just to summarize what actually happened um it was an amazing night i really feel like people who work in rum's kitchen must really have a fun at work because everyone was breaking down <laughs> the barmen management um the colleagues it was just a really really good vibe apart from the fact that i got a ticket but we're not going to talk about that 
so anyway tonight is my friend's birthday so we're gonna go obliques again i have actually gone to obliques before i went to obliques west which is actually a separate restaurant from obliques east which i didn't know or blix or blix whatever at shard so this is my ootd excuse all the mess in the background i'm wearing this blazer from empower clothing um so instagram i got it from some in i'll put it below anyway it's on instagram so i got this from there love it to bits normal trousers excuse my pot belly i've got my got my celine handbag which i'm absolutely loving don't watch the suitcase i'm going away later this week you all are coming anyway so i'll show you and of course i've got so case on on the right foot this time, yeah? in Brighton as I've just been saying so I'm on a work trip um this evening so I'm leaving first thing in the morning for going dinner this evening so I'm just gonna quickly have a next shower another shower do my makeup get dressed and then meet them there so I think it's that uh, they said oh hold on they said that we're gonna get a bottle of wine when we come in where's my wine no no wine anyway just double check because I swear I read on the internet somewhere that there's a complimentary bottle of wine but anyway, no wine. I'm not getting any wine. <laughs> I needed one after the journey that I, I had to get here. But um, I'm 15 minutes earlier than anticipated, which is completely fine. I clearly didn't book this hotel. That's all I've got to say. But I'm grateful nonetheless, you know? Got to count your blessings. Anyway, I'm going to get ready now. Hey, guys. So I'm ready to go now. I'm wearing the same top that I wore in the other vlog. Um, she in wearing it again because it's my business and I've uh, I purchased it so why not these um jeans ego shoes and my Celine bag so yeah so yeah let me actually run you all down and tell you what we're doing so um we've been told to meet at a uh, Indian restaurant um what they have said is that I was supposed to be there from 6 30 so oh, what's the time they said drinks at 6 30 Drinks at 6 30, but um we have to be there by 7 15. It's 5 to 7 at the moment, and it's an eight-minute walk, so I'm just gonna walk down. Um, I'll probably do some videoing of the water, but um I've got a cold and I feel like I'm probably gonna wear my jacket, although I didn't plan on doing that, but I think it's the best thing to do because I don't want to get worse than I already am. But I'll see you all shortly. I actually thought 
that it was going to be a bit cooler than it is but I'm actually happy with the weather to be fair considering we're at the seafront as you can see she's right behind me um yeah I anticipate it to be a bit more windier than it is so I'm glad that it's not too windy but anyway I'm just walking to the restaurant oh my god I need to burn these calories I've put on so much weight <sighs> anyway I'll see you when I get there hotel it was really nice this evening we went to an indian restaurant yeah it was an indian restaurant i didn't want to take out my phone and start like recording my food or recording what was going on um obviously i'm with my colleagues I have to be a bit professional you know but yeah the food was really good so i had well i have for starters i had some chicken something i don't know um cauliflower which was really good and some aubergines as well which was really good and then my main, I had Rogan Josh because I'm just a Rogan Josh lady. I love my Rogan Josh, lamb Rogan Josh and um, naan bread. I didn't stay for dessert because I couldn't even finish my main. Portions were huge. So just got back. Um, I'm going to take off my makeup, have a shower and go to bed. I'm not actually going to stay for breakfast tomorrow. I feel like I just want to be home at a good enough time to like log in and just sort of like you know i don't want to get home at nine i want to actually be in front of my computer with my cup of tea have had my breakfast by then so i'm probably going to go sainsbury's and buy a donut or go greg's because i did see one here and buy a cake or something i don't know something edible but it was a good experience i'm only here for a night i didn't get a time to go to like the beachfront or anything like that i did want to buy a magnet and some rock I did see some stores open whilst I was on my way to the restaurant but of course because of the time I've left it all closed and I'm sure they're not going to be open by the time I leave tomorrow morning so I'll probably have to come back to Brighton on another occasion it was so easy and simple to come I definitely feel like I will because I don't feel like driving all the way up here who knows whatever guys I'll see you all when I'm home or something have a good night I'm sure many of you guys are not going to be watching it at night but you're still getting the good night same way. Bye, people.